that would be the worst thing in the world to see little kids get hit by a car. That was this woman's worst fear while in the car Friday morning. She didn't want to show her face or use her name, so we'll call her Cynthia. I noticed two little kids out kind of close to the street, so I slowed down. As I got closer, I noticed there wasn't a guardian, and I stopped. I was in the center, and the kids started to step out into the street. Cynthia says she laid on her horn so the kids would stop. Even just having seen these kids that weren't my own made me sick to my stomach. Samantha Crouch says she saw the whole thing too. And while others corralled the kids, she went inside where an employee told her. The latch on the gate went two ways and was very confusing and that they would do more training on that gate latch. I found that answer to be grossly unacceptable. I mean, at the end of the day, these facilities have a duty to protect and they have a duty to put in certain safeguards. Gilbert police say they're investigating, but don't expect any criminal charges. But attorney Michael Gergenti like says they could still face uh, were, civil consequences. Just like a parent is not allowed to leave a child unattended in a car, um, a facility absolutely is not allowed to leave a door unlocked and potentially allow toddlers to escape the building and access a busy street. For Samantha and Cynthia, it is something they will not soon forget. The daycare needs to, you know, make, keep better eye on the kids. I mean, I understand accidents happen, things happen, but staff should have paid better attention to those kids.